Hi, uh, this video tutorial I will cover uh, authentication filter. Uh, suppose say uh, client send uh, request to the hello world servlet. Okay, so before uh, hello world servlet uh, receive the request and uh, process the request, uh, we want to do some kind of uh, authentication. Uh, means uh, we want to check uh, whether username and password combination entered by the user in the login page is proper or not. So that kind of validation we want to do. Then uh, what we can do is we can introduce this uh, authentication filter, okay? And uh, in authentication filter, we can write a logic uh, of uh, checking username and password is correct or not. If it is correct, then it will uh, send the request to the hello world uh, servlet. If it is not correct, then what it will do is it will uh, uh, display the message saying uh, your username and password uh, are not correct. Please re-enter, okay? Uh, now we will see how to write an authentication filter. I will open Eclipse and uh, I will show you the project and uh, how to deploy and I will show you the output also. Okay. Uh, I have created this uh, project called authentication filter demo. Uh, first what I will do is I will uh, deploy this uh, web application. File, export, select war file, next and I am placing the war file inside the Tomcat uh, web apps folder okay finish then I am going to start the server uh, server has been uh, started so you can see uh, that uh, authentication filter is initialized okay uh, now I am going to access the web application using this URL. I have given the path till uh, context path which is uh, authentication filter demo. Okay. I am going to enter. Mm, then it is displaying the username, password and uh, uh, login button. So basically it is displaying the uh, welcome page uh, which is uh, index.html. So I am opening uh, index.html in Eclipse. So it has uh, username and password and uh, uh, submit button and once you click this one uh, it will send a request to the server the action is hello and uh, method is get okay so here uh, what i will do is i will give uh, correct username and password which is uh, admin admin so i'm clicking uh, login okay so now uh, you are seeing uh, welcome to hello servlet okay Uh, suppose uh, if I give a wrong username and password then what happens is uh, it will display username or password is uh, not correct okay so once we click on login page uh, the request goes to the web server and the URL pattern is uh, hello okay and the web server will forward the request to the servlet container then uh, servlet container what it will do is uh, it will check the URL pattern hello is there in the web.xml so I am opening Eclipse uh, so here uh, the URL pattern hello is there so the servlet container will identify the corresponding uh, servlet class so in this case uh, corresponding servlet class is hello servlet uh, so it will initialize this uh, hello servlet and uh, before uh, executing this hello servlet it will execute uh, authentication filter because for the same URL uh, pattern hello, we configured authentication filter. Okay. So first uh, servlet container will uh, execute authentication filter. Then it will execute the uh, hello servlet. Okay. Now we will see uh, uh, authentication filter. So this authentication filter uh, implements uh, filter interface. And it has uh, three methods. The first method is uh, init. So this method will be called by the servlet container to initialize this uh, authentication filter. And uh, next method is uh, do filter method. Uh, this method will be called by the servlet container uh, to do the filtering process. And uh, another method is uh, destroy. Uh, this method will be called by the servlet container uh, to take uh, this authentication filter out of service. Okay. Uh, next we will see hello servlet.java. Uh, this hello servlet uh, extends uh, HTTP servlet and it has uh, three methods. The first method is init. 
this method will be called by the servlet container to initialize this uh, hello servlet and uh, it has uh, do get method this method is used to process the request and uh, send the response back to the client okay so here uh, what we have uh, written is uh, just uh, writing uh, welcome to hello servlet in the uh, print writer of uh, response object okay and it has uh, destroy method uh, this method will be called by the servlet container to take uh, this hello servlet out of service okay and uh, next uh, we will see uh, in uh, do filter what kind of uh, code is there okay so in do filter method what we are doing is we are uh, getting the username and password if uh, username and password is admin then uh, we are uh, sending the request to the next resource so in this case uh, next resource is hello servlet okay Suppose uh, username and password is uh, wrong, then uh, we are just displaying uh, username or password is not correct. Okay. So in this uh, first case, that is, if username and password is right, then hello servlet will be executed by the servlet container. If it is wrong, then hello servlet won't be executed. Uh, user will get uh, this error message. So that is what uh, I have shown initially. Okay and uh, this is about how to write authentication filter and uh, thanks for watching bye